Welcome to the shed. This is Ice Out Images reporting from my car at Zenders Splash Village. So, of course, I dropped my lighter. Hold on. First, I want to apologize for my steering wheel being in the um, in the frame. I didn't bring my tripod. I didn't originally plan on doing any videos. Um, but. That was because I failed on picking up some flour before leaving on vacay. So I had two dart pods that I had already done reviews on, already smoked on, all that good shit. So I figured, fuck it. Hop on Google, let's see if there's any wreck dispos close enough. Sure as shit, there's one about 10 miles away from here. I will put a picture in picture somewhere probably over here um, of the actual store the way it looks then I will do the same for each bud because they have it pictures of them good pictures of the buds from it because I bought some pre-rolls you know I just decided to do some pre-rolls you know we're not trying to break the bank on vacay you know we're already spending money this way so place is called highest level health it says Michigan's best cannabis over 82 awards and counting so there's that and as I said I'll put a picture of what the building looks like um, and then I will show you what the receipt looks like I made an online order Three pre-rolls at 12 bucks a pop, 41.25. I get it, that's, uh, you know, if I had a scale with me, I'd weigh them out, see if they're 0.8 or one gram total. I haven't looked at them yet. So you're running through this with me as I'm doing everything. So i gonna crack the bag. Let me be the first to say, hopefully you guys are having a very good day. Okay, so that one's not mine. That one's not mine. This one's mine, so this is the one I'm going to do first. And I'm glad I picked it up. So, I'll do these later, but I have to do them with the other person because they paid for them. So it says, high level health. Miracle Alien Cookie type hybrid weight one gram or one slash 28th of an ounce. Total THC is 18.52%. Total CBD is 0.09%. Actual value may vary by 10%. Is what it says right there. So that's that one. Then one of the other ones I'll do is guava. It's an indica. Same thing, one gram. This is 19.73% THC. Total CBD is 0.06%. And I'll get into that when I actually smoke it. So the one I'm actually gonna review, so the only one that really matters in this video at the moment, Cataract Kush, it's an indica. Same thing, one gram or one slash 28th of an ounce. Total THC is 23.68%, zero CBD. And then it's got poison control number, tested by Steadfast Labs. Harvest date was 5-22-2020. Test date was 06-24-2020. And then you got your test badge. You got your uh, I've never seen that one before Met, I would say metric but the, the I is not in front of it so it's M E T R C I D number and that's at that very bottom there's the rest of this stuff and uh, I got my handy dandy lighter, so we're gonna crack this, take a smell, take a dry hit. 
take a bunch of rips, talk about it. I haven't smoked today yet. I haven't even eaten yet, so after I do this, I'll probably go fucking eat something. Yeah, that smells pretty fucking dank. And they use uh, element cones. And look at that. That is a nice size fucking cone. I've gone to places and paid around the same and had that much of a cone. You know, and you're paying like maybe 15 from those places. Uh, hell yeah. As I said, I will put a picture of this bud in this video since this is the one I'm showcasing. Um, the others, when I do the other videos, I will have pictures and it'll be specifically from their website. So it'll show you what an eighth price is. So if you're ever at Splash Village and you need some weed, it's literally behind me 10 miles, you know, at a slight angle. You know, it's not like one straight road all the way down. It's like a windy road. It's actually a nice scenic view. A lot of farmland, uh, probably like four or five churches I saw. Fire in the hole, guys. Well, not fire in the hole yet. Dry hit. Can't get the best dry hit just because this isn't um, open, so it's airtight. On the dry hit, I'm going to go with like a sweet... I'm gonna just say sweet. It's hard to get anything on the dry hit. But we're gonna, as I said, we're gonna fire in the hole, we're gonna rip this bitch, and then um, I will also, since I know how to do picture in picture now, I will put it in the description below all the information I find on Leafly about this, but I will also put the picture in picture of the description that way also. Just looking to make sure there's no freaking cameras to catch me. Sitting outside last night hitting the fucking vape pen and cop rolls right up. It's like, ah, fuck. As soon as he rolled away, we're like, fuck it, we're going back inside. So that part was all paper. Sorry if you can hear my fan, it's just really warm out at the moment. the paper a little bit more all right what would I contribute that taste to Herbally, not real sweet. <coughs> Tastes very good. I am very glad I got this one. I can't wait to try the Miracle Alien cookie since I've had that and some waxes and stuff. <coughs> Sorry about that. And that one's always been fucking good. I guess herbally, a little pungent. I'm gonna definitely say uh, dry eye is gonna be one of the number ones just because it is an indica. So I am gonna feel it right here like I'm starting to. A little bit of dry mouth, but I think that's just how thick the smoke is. It's just coating my tongue. No, no bite in the back from this. Tastes real good. I wish I could attribute it to a specific flavor, specific something so that you guys could grasp what I'm tasting right now. Mm. 
and was watching uh, housekeeping, cleaning uh, the sliding glass windows as I'm out here blazing. <laughs> and then in a little bit, I'm gonna go put my swimsuit on. I'm gonna go in high as hell, and I'm gonna go start swimming and having a good time with my son. You know? Not that I have to be high to have a good time with my son. I just, I like smoking. Uh, smoking to relax, go inside, sit in a pool. You go to a pool to relax. And then I got my son enjoying the pool and I get to go down all the fucking slides with him and shit. But uh, I don't know how you social distance in a fucking pool with like 50, 60 other people. Just, just throwing that out there. I don't want him to close it down because I'm having fun. But if you were super avid about COVID and social distancing and things like that, this is not the place for you, I promise you. You got shit tons of people in the pool. You get the, uh, the chlorine and shit that goes up your nose, so you're constantly doing this and putting your hands back in the pool. So everyone's touching their face constantly. Your face is in the water. Uh, you come up from the water after breathing, you start coughing. Like it's, think about every time you, you swam in a fucking pool, like a normal pool. So, if, if you're definitely avid about that shit, right now, during these times, this is not the place for you. Big giant water parks where there's gonna be a shit ton of people, it's just not, I don't really care so much. I'm either gonna get it or I'm not. Obviously, it is a real thing, so it's not me uh, looking down on anything or anyone. I see a guy come outside with a fucking walkie-talkie as I got a big-ass doobie man. So, before I hit it again, I'm going to wait until he, he bounces. And, uh, hopefully, uh, I don't got to relight it. But, yeah, um, obviously it's a real thing. It is killing people. So, I don't want to downplay it. You know, so for anyone that's watching, definitely not trying to downplay it at all. I'm just trying to tell you, and give people fair warning like hey if you were like hey i'm gonna go to splash village next weekend i'm gonna social distance and wear my mask it's you can wear your mask but most people don't wear a mask in a pool you go in a pool it gets soaked it gets wet the other people you know so if it lives on surfaces why wouldn't it live in water unless chlorine kills it from being in the water i don't know i'm just throwing it out there just stoner talk, I guess you would say. Um, so, I'm really fucking high. Like, like, and that's how much I smoked today. Like, yeah, as I said, this is the first time I smoked today. Um, but I'll show you my eyes. I feel really, really lazy, like pie-eyed. <laughs> ah, damn. Got ash all over the fucking guy. So, if you are out this way and you can get your hands on cataract, this cataract kush, it's 45 and 8, then $12 a dude. So, $12 a gram isn't bad. I just hate buying things in grams and I hate buying things in eights these days, man. I hate it. I fucking get an eighth and I gotta go fucking scale it immediately because it looks like I got ripped off. I remember back in the day when I was fucking smoking, like you go get an eighth, you know, you could do like one finger length across the bottom of a bag, you do two finger lengths and, uh, you know, you, I'm pretty sure it was a quarter, it was two finger lengths at the bottom of a bag, so, but, yep, take another rip off this. So, Cataract Kush, get your hands on it. Like, sub, comment, hit that bell. And the place is called High Level Health, and it's out here in Frankenmuth. So, as I said, it's like 10 miles away from Zender Splash Village. Can't go wrong. Fucking shit's amazing. Definitely an indica. 
uh, dry mouth, dry eyes to high hell. As I said, I showed you how fucking pie-eyed I am. You've seen me in normal videos, so pretty fucking lit. So thank you, highest level health, and everybody else. Thank you for watching. Get your hands on it.